Hey guys, my name is N6420, and today I'm doing a review for episode 11 of Marvel Spider-Man. This one is about Man-Wolf. This was a Halloween special version since it's, since it's October. And, uh, yeah, since it's October, they're doing Halloween and stuff. And today, in this episode, we got to see, uh, um, well, two people. We got to see, um, Man-Wolf and, uh, Honk. So the episode begins with, um, so let's get into this. So the episode begins with Peter actually trying to get to Horizon High because there's a Halloween party going on and he invited Harry and what they're going to be was a, um, was like a horse, like, you know, those like little horses where like, um, like the horse costume where like, um, like one the person's like in the front, one person's in the back. Yeah, he was supposed to do that. He was supposed to do that, but he was late. So he was trying to get over there, but then panic starts happening in the park. So he heads over there to the park and he sees that that um it's not that um people will run away from a danger and he thinks it's a bear or a lion and then he sees that it's actually a man wolf and then he's actually trying to actually like the man wolf is actually trying to is actually pinned spidey um peter to um he's pinned spidey into like the wall until hulk comes out of nowhere and says he's like he says that it's time to smash so um he does that and like um like he does actually like like um start to actually fight the man wolf hulk starts to fight the man wolf but in doing so um, the man wolf actually kind of drains some of Honk's gamma radiation, so some of his, so some of Honk's gamma is actually kind of gone, so, so he goes back to being Bruce Banner, and then after that, um, Spidey actually decide, Spidey actually webs the, um, man wolf to a wall, and, um, and, um, they started, um, Peter, like, um, Spider-Man and, um, Honk started actually, or Bruce Banner actually started to have a talk about, like, um, how man wolf was there. And then, um, they realize that Man Wolf was gone, so they go back and try to find him. Oh. And, um, apparently, um, when they're trying to find him, um, Peter, um, Peter's phone rings, and when he re and he picks it up, um, it's apparently Harry telling him that the Man Wolf is there at Horizon High, so he heads over there. So Peter heads over there with Hulk over there, or Bruce Banner, and they fight the Man Wolf over there, but what the Man Wolf has done is that, um, apparently whoever he actually, like, like, um, scratches or, like, um, claws, um, or slashes, they turn into a wolf as well, so, yeah, that's actually kind of, like, a little effectiveness. And this is actually kind of actually pretty cool, because, and this episode was kind of unexpected, because the last time we saw a man-wolf in a cartoon was Unlimited, was Spider-Man Unlimited, and that was, like, back in the 90s, and this is, and we come here, or, like, actually, no, because there was Ultimate, but... But basically, don't try to. But people try to forget that Ultimate existed. But let's just say that, like, because um, Man Wolf was kind of like a unexpected, like a little like n unknown villain. Uh, people kind of remember him, but some actually don't. I'm not saying like you, 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 and everyone else that you know does remember him. I'm just saying that some of the majority kind of don't actually remember him. So it's cool to see him actually be like brought back, even though he was brought back in Ultimate. Anyways, um, yeah, it's pretty cool to see him back. Anyways, back to the back to the review. Um, he, Aris, so man wolf has the ability to actually when he slashes somebody, they turn into a man wolf. So yeah, so you see Peter actually trying to fight the man wolf by himself because Bruce, because um Bruce Banner's Honk and this is not there anymore until Honk comes back. But during this, during the battle, um, when Honk's trying to get back to being, when Bruce Banner's trying to become the Honk, um, Man Wolf's, um, victims that he slashed start to turn into wolves. So, um, yeah. So they go after Spider-Man, but then it's luckily that, um, Honk actually, actually turned, that Bruce Banner turns into Honk because he can actually help Spider-Man. So Honk actually decides to actually fight Man Wolf, and Spider tries to handle the three other wolves, but, P but, um, Gwen and Harry are there. I forgot to mention that. Gwen and Harry are there still. And they lock down the whole building. That way, um, no other... That way, the man wolves don't actually get out of nowhere. Anyways, um, after that, um, they, um, it's revealed that there's, a, that they can keep the wolves, like, the remaining wolves, not the main one, but, like, the troopers that he ha that the man wolf has, in a vault. So they put him in a vault. And then, um, they try... But man wolf is gone, so they try to find him. So, Gwen comes an idea to actually make, um, gamma radiation, um, seekers or trackers. So they can actually find it. And then during this, um, they get split into groups, and then, um, um, Hulk gets put with Gwen, and then, um, Spider-Man gets put with Harry. So they move around, and Harry and Spider-Man have a little chat until gamma radiation comes up. So they head over there, they realize it was, um, they actually realize, because, um, where they went was that where the Hulk was, but they thought it was Hulk, but it was above them where, um, where the, where, um, the man-wolf is. 
Anyways, anyways, they get back to it, and then, um, Hong starts to fight the man wolf, but then the wolves break out, but then after, but before that actually happens, um, the, um, man wolf, like, is actually turning back to John Jameson, because, um, um, Peter, Gwen, and Harry actually found, or, like, Gwen found what actually contained, like, the stone that I had, um, I forgot to mention that, um, um, yeah, so, um, they take it back to stone, right, but then, it, um, um, at the, like, when, during, when Hong and man wolf are fighting, um, they actually, um, Hulk got slashed by it, so he turns to, like, a Hulk, like, a Hulk wolf, I guess. So he turns to a wolf, Hulk turns to a wolf, so they actually try to find another way, until he realized that, um, that, um, they have to get rid of his gamma radiation, even though that his is not even a stone, it's, he makes it himself, so they go back to, they find a lab where they can actually, like, um, like, get some weapons for Harry, Jameson, and Gwen. So, while, so, during, um, when, um, while, um, Harry and... Gwen and Jameson are actually, um, duking it out, like, not duking it out, but, like, um, trying to keep the other wolves, like, trying to keep man, um, Hulk away, um, so he gets the container that Gwen has, which has, like, the stone, because a stone can drink gamma radiation, he takes the stone, and he takes it, like, and he drains Hulk to, the Hulk wolf to Hulk, and then he drains the Hulk to Bruce Banner, so after that, um, after the radiation from Hulk is gone, and Hulk is Bruce Banner, the wolves start to turn back, and then at the end of the episode, we see, um, the like the hospital or like police or like I don't know firefighters I guess I don't know um take the people that were actually in custody or like not custody but like were under control of like that got infected or was kind of like temporarily infected with a man wolf and then after that we see that um Jameson um Jameson was actually instructed to become a man wolf for field test by Norman Osborn and then Norman Osborn gets kind of like mad at him because he got his son involved which is Harry but during this um but after that um um, we see Harry and Peter actually start talking about it, and they see, and they kind of, like, give, like, a life lesson, I guess. So, yeah, that's the end of the episode. And then, um, people start telling that people, I forgot to mention this, people start telling people that, um, they turn into a wolf, but like, people don't believe him, but, yeah, that's, that's kind of unexpected. So, yeah, that's the end of the episode. Um, how would I rate it? I'll probably give it, like, a 7.5 out of 10. Um, yeah, it's not the greatest episode, but it's, like, a, it's okay episode. I would recommend it, I guess. So, yeah, um... That's it, and also, I wanted to thank every one of you guys for giving me to 40 subscribers. I wanted to thank everyone, you, 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 not you, Steve, not you. Get out of here! Get out! Motherfucker, okay, he's gone. Anyways, um, yeah, so hopefully you guys like this episode, please give it a like, and please subscribe for more content, or like, more Spider-Man content. See you guys later, bye-bye!